Hello everyone, welcome back to my motivational series. Guys, here's the thing about support. When you have a support network, when you have people who are helping you daily to prosper, to become more abundant, when you have more money, guys, nothing is better in life. Guys, it's better to have more than less. It's better to do more than do less. It's better to give more than take. Just hold that thought. Guys, make sure that if you want to prosper and to prosper in life and to make sure that you're getting to better places, you have to make sure that you have the best people around you. Now, the best people are those people who are lifting you up and those people who are giving you money. All right? Now, those people who give you money for your services, they are the people that lift you up. Those people who educate you to become better, those people are the people to be around. Now, just because your business clients are giving you money, doesn't mean that you have to be around them. It just means that they are your support network, okay? Those who help you to grow in terms of finances, in terms of wisdom, in terms of traveling, in terms of anything in life, are actually your friends, okay? So being around positive people and those who inspire you are the best way is the best way to go about life okay there's nothing better than a person who helps you now there are friends who are going to be your friends but they're not gonna lift you up now those friends are not friends they're not growing you okay they're just wasting your time okay and just having a connection buddy for the sake of connection is not the best idea the best idea is have a connection support a person who connects with you but lifts you through that connection okay not everyone's going to lift you so you have to make sure that you are around people who are always inspiring you and lifting you up and growing you that's the best way to live life live life in a way that no matter what happens you will always be able to gain more friends to influence more people to have more money to grow more to educate more to be educated even more guys being a student of life is the only way to be because those who know it all are experts in their fields and are broke today guys those people who know what to do when to do it and why to do it those people are actually broke okay never be a know-it-all okay make sure that you are someone who has the experience and gains the experience to be able to achieve all your goals now the ultimate goal of life is to be better than yesterday so what do I mean by that I mean that if you're drinking alcohol today think about when you came into this life did you drink alcohol at the moment that you came into this world no did you smoke cigarettes the moment that you came into this world no so obviously try to get to that baby state that you came into the world okay for example myself I came into the world I never ate meat and then I was born in a family where there were people who ate meat right so I started to challenge my four my father's family my mother's family and I became a vegan okay because I challenged society's thinking okay so that's what you have to do you have to challenge people because Poisoning yourself is never the right idea and it never helps you in any kind of way Okay to be abundant to be prosperous The only way to do it is to be sober and to make sure that you are getting ahead in life now The more sober you are in life the bigger support network you're going to have the bigger network of friends You're going to have the easier you're going to make friends the more you're confident you're going to be the easier you're going to speak the more fluent you're going to be the better public speaker you're going to be the better everything in life just stay sober for two years it's a big difference guys but sobriety is not enough yes it's a big difference to say to stay sober and yes it's going to increase your lifespan for, for five years okay staying sober in life actually increases your lifespan by minimum five years so becoming vegan on top of that will give you another 10 years extra to live okay and then doing meal preps that is just one to three minutes to make your dinner or to make your food to make your lunch throughout the day 
that's another time investment in yourself okay it only takes me one to three minutes guys it takes me one to three minutes to make my food every single day I never have to cook my food I never have to boil my food okay I never have to peel my food I never have to refrigerate my food I never have to toast my food I never have to microwave my food I never have to shop for most of the vegetables out there I never have to shop for most of the fruit out there guys it's all time wasting picking an apple for five minutes which one's correct guys that is time wasting okay guys the most important way to live your life is to make a schedule where you are investing your time in the best places in every single moment okay that's the best way there's nothing better than a person who has the best schedule in life so guys make sure that whatever happens you're doing your best and achieve sobriety make sure you're sober make sure you're sober today and become vegan guys it's the best way to go and make sure that you always have a support network hey guys here's the thing about going to the beach in summer no matter if you're fat if you're ugly if you have a hot body or whatever it is if you're walking on the beach take your shirt off take your shirt off all the time okay make sure it's sunny make sure it's beautiful and take your shirt off for 10 minutes because it's gonna make you feel much better about who you are now those people who always go to the beach to put on their shirts to put on their jumpers and to just be on the beach with their whole skin covered in a hot day means they lack self-esteem and lack confidence guys be able to show your skin more and more for the world and that way people are going to give you reactions and you are going to have to see that and what's going to happen is you you are actually going to improve by showing off your body more okay and this is why because when you grab reactions of other people okay they're gonna be like yeah man you need to improve and you're gonna see that you feel much better about who you are as a person when you've taken your shirt off when you can show your, your skin no matter if you're you're very fat if you're obese no matter what happens in life when you can take off your shirt and you can show off who you are as a person that's so much more attractive than a person who is covering themselves up okay so if you want to become a hundred times more attractive make sure you take off your shirt make sure you're showing off your skin all the time you'll become a thousand more times attractive than covering yourself just make sure that when you do take off your shirt make sure to look at the surroundings and just to be yourself who gives a fuck about what people say no one's perfect in life okay no one's perfect in life so what you have to do is you just have to show off your flaws at first show the person you are and take responsibility for your body once you take responsibility by showing your body for the world guess what's going to happen you are actually going to start improving because you've exposed yourself the more you can expose yourself guys the better off you're going to be so make sure that you expose yourself even more throughout daily life and that way you're actually going to become more popular popular people expose themselves guys make sure to become more popular to become more happy to have more money to have more time freedom to be a social influencer is to show yourself to the world to expose who you are as a person okay and the more you expose your body and who you are the more happier the more abundant the richer you are okay just keep that in mind guys and make sure that the next time you go to the beach just take off your shirt for 10 minutes it's gonna make you feel tremendous okay it's gonna make you feel the best so why not do it okay make sure that no matter what happens in life you're prospering you're becoming the best you can be because life is about exploring life is about showing off okay so show yourself off even more today hey guys do you know what the, the thing about life the thing about life is you have to be on top of life in order to get somewhere if you're not on top of life do you know what's going to happen you are actually going to become less in life you have to become more and the only be, the only way to become more is to grow more okay so to grow is to be ahead to grow is to be ahead of the times make sure that no matter what's in your life right now that you are intentionally growing yourself so that you can become the best version of yourself guys 
It's about becoming the best version. That's what the happiness is. That is what life is. It's either grow or die. It's either become rich or die. Okay? There's no in between. It's either pick one or the other. You cannot have health and have your best self at the same time. I mean, you cannot have alcohol and drugs and have your best self at the same time. What you need to be doing every single day is reading something that's going to help improve you in some aspect of your life. That's the only way to live. That's the only way to go about life. It's either grow or do nothing at all. Okay? And those who grow achieve their dreams all the time. Alright? So achieve your dreams today by growing and making sure that you're getting places, making sure that you're planning, making sure you're doing your best every single day because it's worth it. Guys, it may be difficult at first, but guess what? When you get going, all right, and you start growing second by second, and you take one little step at a time in growth, guys, it gets easier and easier, all right? So make sure that no matter what happens in life, you are growing every second because that is how you live over 100, okay? You become interested in life. You become open-minded. You become curious. That's how to live life, guys. Make sure you're, you're growing right now. Make sure you're growing. Make sure you're inspiring yourself every single day because that's how you're going to inspire other people, okay? So make sure that no matter what, you're becoming more disciplined, increasing your knowledge, increasing your confidence, your skills, your courage, and your athletic performance, okay? That's how you live life. That's how you become a better person. Hey guys, so here going to Tasmania. Guys, make sure you're traveling. Make sure you're living life. Make sure that you're growing. Because you get to travel the world, and that's the best thing of life, guys. Make sure, that you're make sure that no matter what, your life is how it's supposed to be, and make sure it's better always. The perks of living life to the fullest means that. You get to travel the world and you get to see airplanes like this. Look at that. Amazing. There you go. You guys are here going to Tasmania. You guys, make sure you're traveling, make sure you're living life. Make sure that you're growing because you get to travel the world and that's the best thing of life, guys. Make sure that, make sure that no matter what, your life is how it's supposed to be and make sure it's better always. The perks of living life to the fullest means that you get to travel the world and you get to see airplanes like this. Look at that. Amazing. There you go. You guys are here going to Tasmania. Guys, make sure you're traveling, make sure you're living life. Make sure that you're growing, because you get to travel the world, and that's the best thing of life, guys. Make sure, make sure that no matter what, your life is how it's supposed to be, and make sure it's better always. The perks of living life to the fullest means that you get to travel the world, and you get to see airplanes like this. That. Amazing. There you go. Hey guys, do you know what's the amazing thing about life? It's that when you become the best version of yourself, nothing in life is going to stop you. No one in life will shake you. No one will underestimate you. No one will overestimate you. Do you know why? Because who gives a fuck what they think anyway? about your life it's about where are you going so determining your path right now by planning ahead is the best way to move forward when you can succeed even more than you are capable right now that is when you can become happier more success equals more happiness Plus, more money equals more success try to gain more money in your life the best way to do that is to improve your mindset Read daily. Make sure you're reading. Okay, it's very important. When you can write, 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 write every single day, your thoughts on paper. I promise you, you're going to be able to speak very fluently and very 
fashionably, okay? If you don't think fantastic in life, and the only person that's going to ever be fantastic in life is the person who is loving themselves. Right? Excellence is about integrity. Live your talk. If you say something, live it, breathe it, own it, and be about it. Okay? Stand for it. There's no point in saying something to someone when you're not doing it. Okay? So, the best way of moving forward right now is about yourself and where you are in life. Guys, learn how to learn. Okay? Learn your communication style. Learn how you are as a person. Learn what you love and what you hate. Learn what you need and what you don't need. Okay? There's a big difference between wants and needs. Make sure you only need something in life. Okay? Only give your money towards the things that you need. Because most of your wants you never need anyway. Your needs are more important than wants. So the most important thing that you can do right now is make sure that throughout life you're connecting with people, you're supporting people, you're helping them, you're giving value. And guys, that's all that you can do. Okay? The more value you give, the more popular you become. That's all it is in life. Give value and make sure that whatever you are good at right now, make sure you practice that craft for life. Because I promise you, you are going to become very rich in that craft just by practicing daily. Okay? Make sure that no matter what happens, you are straightforward in your life. Okay? Going upward. And make sure that no matter what, never let someone tell you what to do. Okay? Let someone show you what to do, but never boss you around. Never be bossed around by anyone. Okay? When you work for someone, make sure that you're only working for yourself. Never work for anyone else. Guys, life is about the journey. Okay? There's no destination. It's only a journey. And the only way that you can live a journey and that you can live life is by growing. Grow daily, guys. Grow daily and you'll never regret it. The only important thing in life is that you're making sure that you're growing daily and that you're better than yesterday. That is the foundation of life. That is the foundation of empathy. Empathy is growth. The more you can become an empath in life, the more you can lead. The more you can be disciplined. The more you can be motivated. Guys, become more motivated today by growing yourself daily, by reading, by gaining more wisdom. Hey guys, do you know the thing about Hobart is when you come out from the airport, about two kilometers you have to walk in order to get yourself a public transport bus, okay? Or you can catch a bus from the airport and give $20 and arrive to your destination. Now the thing that I would love to elaborate on is sometimes the best thing you can do is walk an extra 20 minutes to have an extra $15 so that you can have an extra night in Tasmania. Guys, that's sacrifice, right? But while you are walking to your destination for 20 minutes, read something. In that 20 minutes, I can read one hour, okay? So guys, make sure that when you are walking, that you are also reading something, that you are also improving yourself, okay? Not everything is about getting there fast, okay? Yes, when you're, when you're a millionaire, when you have a lot of money, okay? And w what do you even define as a lot of money, guys? Like, to be honest, a lot of money is a small amount of money, okay? A trillion dollars is one penny, okay? A millionaire is only a millionaire because they are healthy, okay? A millionaire is defined as a healthy person. A person who can be healthy in life can also achieve everything, okay? So the whole point of life is to make sure that you think smart, okay? You're not just throwing away your money at random places, okay? Sometimes an extra night somewhere, okay? By lowering your means first, lower your means so that you can enjoy more experience, okay? So when you are born in a middle class to lower family, okay, a middle class family or a family that's very poor, guys, sometimes you have to really really invest your finances properly okay you have to be able to cut those expenses and each time you do walk an extra 20 minutes or you do gain a 15 dollars a day okay guys it makes up a big difference over over time for you especially 
And then what you can do with that money is you can educate yourself. You can gain more experience, okay? You can get yourself something. You can treat yourself, okay? So walk that extra 20 minutes to have an extra $15 when you are not a millionaire, okay? But when you're a millionaire, yes, use money to, tra to get transport. Get yourself a taxi all, all, all day long, okay? But when you're not a millionaire, make sure that you are walking through life and looking at the adventure just because you came to Hobart and other people are catching a bus to their destination by giving $20 straight away doesn't mean that you have to okay check up on your navigation see what's available where is the nearest public transport you give $5 instead of 20 okay think smarter guys there are always better deals out there okay just because someone says oh take this bus and it costs $20 doesn't mean that you have to do it okay yeah, when you go to a tour, tourist guide, a person who, who apparently knows about Tasmania or about South Australia and about where to travel, guys, never listen to that person. Just listen to your heart. Listen to where you want to go, okay? Listen to where you must go in life. Just because a person or people are saying this is the great place to go doesn't mean that it's the best place to go for you. Okay, just because a Ferrari Endzone is one of the best cars in the world doesn't mean that you need it right now. Do you get that? Just because something is popular and people are watching something doesn't mean that you have to watch it. Yeah, just because a TV show in Australia is so popular doesn't mean that you have to turn on the television now to watch it. Okay, guys, mind your own business. Okay, there are a lot of people out there in going in different directions and most of them, 99% of them are fucking poor. And they're going down 99% of people are going down so those people who are watching TV shows they're fucking losing in life okay so no matter what guys make sure that you're investing your time properly and you're reading every day because reading is gonna get you somewhere okay it got me somewhere it definitely got me somewhere I could speak like this guys I, I'm able to pronounce I'm able to speak I'm able to communicate I'm assertive I'm alpha I'm able to throw all these kinds of words at you all these types of vocabularies out, out, of, out of myself to help explain myself much better so that I can pronounce better okay it's about changing the topic of discussion but keeping it simple okay so that everyone can understand that's how you change approach you keep changing approach in communication you can never be one way you just have to be always you have to keep changing and changing and changing that's life guys life is change so the more that you can travel the better for you guys make sure that no matter what you're traveling because that's going to soothe your soul that is the only point of recommendation that is how you grow and that is how you become happier hello guys so currently here in hobart and today is a beautiful day and the thing is about today that you must stay present you must be able to love your life you must be able to become the best version of yourself guys those people who are the best versions of themselves get everywhere in life. They are able to prosper, they are able to become abundant, they are able to push forward, and they are able to become a totally great person, and being a great person is everything in life. So those people who can push their boundaries, push their challenges, gain leverage through business, through finance, through health, through emotional stability, through being independent, by leaving your parents, by traveling to another country, by traveling more, by increasing your confidence, by losing weight, okay, by expanding your life by 10 years, by turning vegan, okay, by being sober for life, okay. Guys, these are all challenges. Now, when you increase one aspect of your life, what happens is you also increase all the other aspects of your life. So the best thing you can do is make sure that you're reading every single day because reading is your best investment ever and it's also the most affordable one. Now, what else you can do is you can hire a coach to train you, okay? But what I suggest is get out your phone and start planning your day-to-day -day life. What do you want to do? Why do you want to do that, okay? What is so good about getting this what is so good about going to this place and you just start journaling daily 
for the next two years, every single day. Okay, and you just write your thoughts down. I love this person because of that. And then each time you write something, write a reasoning behind it. And do you know what's, why this is so important? It's so important for you to do this because when you can see your thoughts on paper, you can actually see and start to see your learning style. And you can start to see what you are learning on a daily basis. When you learn something, write it down. And then you're going to be like, wow, I thought I was so smart about knowing this or about thinking that I know this. But look at me, I just learned that now. And I'm only 27. And then what happens is when you start to grow as a person, when you start to become a better person, when you start to accomplish more, guys, that is the meaning of life. The meaning of life is traveling. It's about being more vibrant. It's about communicating better. It's about being a better person. It's about pushing forward. It's about doing your best to do what you can do. Okay? Make sure you're helping people. Help people and love people. Guys, it's about moving forward. So make sure that you are prospering. Make sure you're becoming abundant. Make sure you're becoming more vibrant, more healthy, more joyful, more happy. Okay? More abundance, more richness. That's what it's about. It's about loving yourself so much that no one can drag you down. Love yourself unshakably. Love yourself so that you become untouchable, that no one can deny you, okay? And when you do business, make sure that you're doing business for yourself only, okay? Now, when you're doing only things for yourself, okay, this is what happens. You start to become happier. You start to become a better person. You start to do more. You start to live more. You start to travel more. You start to have more. Okay, you start to be more. Guys, it's about you. So make sure that life is always centered around you. Make sure that you have an audience and you have followers and you have a big social media. You're a big social media influencer. You're going out there. You're inspiring. You're doing the best you can. You're making sure that you're making videos. You're making sure that no matter what, you're doing the best you can in all areas of life. Guys, life is about all areas. Okay, so increase one area of your life to help yourself achieve better aspects of life. Okay, so the best thing you can do is start with communication. Start to communicate better. Start to be a better person. Start to love better. Start to be better. Start to be more attractive. Start to become more sexier. Start to look inside more, look inside. Stop looking outside for help. Start looking inside, start looking to yourself for answers. Start looking inside your body and be like, how can I do this? How can I love myself more? How can I achieve more? How can I gain more money? How can I cut my expenses? And write your thoughts to paper, okay? It's important to be planning today because planning is going to help you in all areas of life. Now, when you plan one area of your life, you help plan all the other areas also. So, when you can schedule your time properly in a way that's going to help you move forward, guys, that means that you are changing your approach all the time. So, life is about changing your approach. When you can change your approach and change your approach and change it and change it and keep changing it, all right, and you can always give new expressions of life through your communication style, but also through your planning. And each time you write something different and different and different, guess what? You start to improve your communication skills. You start to improve your mindset. You start to improve the person you are. You start to improve your attitude. You start to improve your confidence. You start to improve everything in life that's going to benefit you, okay? Now, life is about benefits. Everyone wants benefits, okay? But the thing is that you need to be able to achieve more you need to be able to love more you need to be able to do more so the best way to do that is to take action take action on what you have heard okay now when you hear something it means that it goes from one ear to the other but when you listen to something when you listen to knowledge that's positive make sure you're applying it make sure that you're doing it in daily life because it's about doing so never mind what i said in this video look that i do i get up on the camera and I'm doing, this is me doing it now. I'm doing me, right? I'm doing my knowledge. I'm doing what I've learned in life, all right? So this is the act of doing. And then when you can act in the moment about what you love to do, 
and do it with your whole heart and your whole soul and you are not scared of anything and you're just pushing forward and you're remaining your mindset to become better and you're making sure that no matter what, even if you fail, who gives a fuck? You lift up and you keep going, all right? Life is about resilience. When you can fall down and get back up, guys, that's the meaning of life. Get back up no matter what. Like, whatever happens, guys, the most embarrassing moments in your life, make sure you are lifting yourself no matter what because no one else is going to lift you but you. Other people can only lift you to the point that you can lift yourself. So when someone's giving you positive ideas, don't just say, that's a good idea, and then never take action upon it. Guys, the whole point of ideas and speaking in ideas is to catch an idea and to grab it and to apply it to your life. So when you're reading a book, don't just read it once. Read it five times, read it ten times until you learn the book off by heart. Okay? That's how you read books. You move on from an audio until you understand the communication level of that video or audio. And nothing until then. So the whole point of life is to cultivate this big, massive attitude that can help you prosper. Okay, that can help you become more abundant. That can help you man up. That can help you become a better person. Okay, it's about becoming a better person so that you can give out your hand and help people in need and help people who need it, okay? When you've, when you've loved yourself enough, okay, then you can go out and love other people. But when you do not love yourself, of course you're going to be immature. Of course you're going to be insecure. Of course you're going to be mentally ill. Of course you're going to be fat. Of course you're going to be poor financially. So what you need to be doing is always looking for areas to grow in. You need to be able to grow daily. Grow daily, no matter what, because no one's going to grow for you, okay? And I never want you to be the person on the street, like a homeless person, singing out, begging for money, because those people never grow. That's why they're on the street. And then they act like victims, like the world is against them. No, no, no one's against you. When you can grow as a person and you can take care of yourself, your finances, your health, your mindset, whatever it is, your confidence, your travels, your, ex your expenditure, guys, you can prosper, you can get ahead, you can do more, you can always love more, okay? So the meaning of life is never do what other people are doing, but do what the best are doing in the best, but in the best way possible, all right? Because you cannot keep doing what other people are doing that are negative, okay? Not everyone is doing the same thing. And not everyone is doing the positive thing. So you have to be careful and you have to label stuff and life areas of what people are doing as negative or positive. So if, if people are drinking alcohol and smoking cigarettes and they offer, offer you a drink or a cigarette, that is a bad thing. That, that is not a good thing. So to say that, oh, you will have this cigarette or this alcohol drink because of a certain thing is stupid. So make sure that no matter what, you're just becoming more of a sober person and loving your life every single day. That's the meaning of life, guys. And just make sure that you're becoming more vibrant because that's how you, that's how, that's how you live life. That's how you get to travel. That's how you get to do things. And nothing else. Guys, thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next video. Guys, motivation is key to your life. Those who can motivate other people and those who can become a better person can lead the world. Guys, no matter what happens, make sure that your habits are improving, your positivity is improving, your mental capacity, your expansion. Look to expand, look to grow, look to become a better person, look to find the words to express yourself. Express yourself in the best ways and make sure that when you're approaching people, you're just in... You're just growing as a person and you're not worried about what people think of you, okay? So when you say something, say it, okay? Never be scared to say something, all right? Speak up. When you're scared to speak up, that's the moment you must speak up because it's about pushing through the fear, okay? So when you are scared to do something, make sure that you do it because that way you're going to gain more confidence in whatever you're scared of doing. 
So if you're scared to quit smoking, obviously when you overcome smoking, you're gonna become a confident person, a more confident person. Obviously when you become sober in life and away from the drugs, you're gonna just become confident because before you were scared to do it, okay? So no matter what, if you're scared to be in front of a crowd and speak in front of a crowd, then that's exactly what you must go through to become a better public speaker. There are no shortcuts in life, but what you can do today is increase your health, you can increase your finances, you can cut expenses, you can start reading today, you can start taking action today, you can start living today, you can start becoming a better person today, you can start traveling today, you can start communicating today, you can start overcoming your fears today, you can start bettering your habits today. Guys, that's what it's about. It's about better, better your habits and then you'll prosper, you'll become more abundant. You'll be able to motivate. You'll be able to become more disciplined. You'll be able to do anything in life. It's about finding the words to say so that you never have to worry about who you are and about what's next because you can always manage to find the words when you're looking inside. You're always managing to become a better person no matter what. And the only way to do that is to always make sure that the words are coming in and that you are expressing yourself in the best way. So when you can express yourself on camera or in front of an audience, then have some pauses also. Make sure you're pausing, okay? It's about pausing as well. It's about looking at the crowd. It's about making the crowd more entertained, okay? So the best thing you can do is just to be yourself on stage and be able to lead yourself and other people to a greater life. Now, in communication, there is no rush. There is no rush anywhere in life. There's no rush to eat, there's no rush to travel, there's no rush to do anything, and never rush for anything or anyone. When you do something, make sure you do it for yourself. Do it for yourself first, and then everything else will come and prosper from that point on. So the best thing you can do now is just make sure that your communication style is in the best way possible right now for you. So then you can keep pushing it to become even better. So you always must be pushing yourself and growing yourself and loving yourself and doing more all the time. There's nothing better than a person who's always inspiring and who is always leading other people to become better. Guys, those people who can lead other people can actually increase your lifespan, they can help you become more positive, they can help you get out of the 9 to 5 job, they can help you do anything in life. So when you can get out of the 9 to 5 job, you're obviously going to be much more of a better person. You're going to have more finances, you're going to have more wealth because people who never worked a 9 to 5 actually have something to do in life. Those people who are in the 9 to 5 usually always are trapped and unhappy and they're drinking alcohol and doing poison and they have no lives and they cannot travel and all they have is a bit of money under 10 grand. Okay? Because guys, make sure that no matter what, you're increasing your financial knowledge. Because when you increase your real estate and financial knowledge, you're going to be able to invest that money much better. And that's the most important thing. When your money is going in the right places, that means you have the best habits, okay? So becoming the best person of the world is becoming the person who can lead others and who can prosper others and prosper yourself at the same time, okay? So it's about leading other people but also leading yourself so that you can do more, so you can be more, so you can do more, so you can have more, so you can love yourself more, so you can achieve more, so you can be more fantastic, okay? Guys, no matter what happens, life is about becoming more fantastic. It's about becoming more awesome. It's about becoming, it's about becoming excellent. Become excellent. Become an excellent person. Become a grateful person. Become someone who is very assertive, someone who is loving, someone who is daring to achieve more, okay? Those people who grow and succeed and love themselves always find something to do, always have something to do, are always, always going places, always traveling to places, always making sure that no matter what happens, they, they are prospering, they are abundant, they are loving themselves, they are achieving more, they are, they are doing more. All right, it's about doing more. So the more you can do, the better for you, okay? Do more to prosper more, to become more abundant, to become more financially free. It's about financial freedom. When you can become financial, financially free, that means that you can achieve more, you can become more, you can do more, okay? So no matter what, 
make sure that when you're sleeping, make sure you're getting enough sleep. Make sure that you're drinking more water in the day because water is always healthy and it's always going to hydrate you. Okay, so water, make sure you're drinking tap water in the country that you're in. Drink tap water if it's healthy, okay? In, for example, in first class countries, tap water is enough, but then people go out and buy water anyway. Why are you buying water when tap water is still good for you in that country? Okay, you just you gain more finances that way. So look for ways to expand your finances, to expand who you are. Okay, but first to increase your finances, you must lower the person who is investing all this money into the wrong places. So you have to be able to lower your means, lower your means first, and then you can expand your means after that. Okay, so once you lower your means, that means that you only invest in the best places and then look for ways to expand your finances by investing in certain assets and an asset is something that is returning you money or something that is going to be of health to you or something that's going to be really helpful for you in terms of maybe you can go traveling. Traveling is always good to invest in. Invest in more travels, invest in better food, invest in better people, invest in more education. Okay, those are the places to invest your money. Okay, so when you're investing your money in the best places possible, obviously you're going to become a better person. Those people who never care about their finances, never track their financing, never do much to see where their money's going, guys, those people are failing every single day. Guys, no matter what, you just have to be able to plan daily, you have to be able to do daily, you have to be able to take action daily, and it's about growing, it's about loving yourself, it's about going to the best places possible. That's what it's about. It's about looking at where you are in life and what do you wanna do from this point. From this point, you have to get to the next point. So what do you have to do? You have to make sure you're taking care of yourself. You have to make sure that no matter what, you're never trying to rush to be someone. You're never trying to rush life. You just have to go one day at a time and you just have to learn bit by bit every single day. And every single day, you must love yourself 100%. And keep your word. When you say something, keep it for the next 50 years. Trust me, when you keep your word, obviously, it's integrity. Integrity is everything in life. When you can keep your word, that's your rolling stone. That's what's going to push you forward, okay? So, keeping your word is everything. From this point forward, you just have to make sure that no matter what, you're loving yourself, you're taking yourself out, you're enjoying, you're traveling, Okay, you're not worrying about anything. You're taking care of your finances always. You're seeing new scenery. You're experiencing new people. Talk with people. Who cares? Give them some time and just relax. Okay, there's no rush. Okay, make friends along the way. Okay, but obviously you cannot take your friends with you. Okay, unless they want to come with you. Okay, so never force anyone to come with you, but just make sure that you are communicating and never limit your communication to anyone. In life so when you have a chance to speak make sure you speak all the time okay always choose communication that way you can become more of an expression of the world okay and it's about expressing yourself it's not about it's not about dragging everything that you have inside of you and then just keeping it for yourself no you have to now go externally and you have to give out okay giving is external okay it's an external way of expression okay so taking a lot from other people is more internal, okay? You're just taking, you're taking, taking, and you're not giving much. So what you wanna be doing is you wanna be doing external ways of thinking in terms of giving, giving, giving. You're always giving value. You're always loving people. The more you can give, the better for you, okay? But when you're really learning, look to learn. Look to learn something that's gonna be of benefit, it's going to be of value, okay? Because it's not about benefit, it's about value. Okay, where is the value? Who is a valuable who is a valuable person today? Where can I find value? How can I get more value? Which books have the best value? How can I increase my value? All right, so those kind of questions you can keep asking yourself and you can keep remembering that you must improve because it's about improvement. Those who never improve never grow. Okay? So, no matter what, it's about expressing your mind in the best ways so that everyone can understand you so that you can be the greatest person out there
because that's what it's about. It's about becoming the greatest person. And even when people do not think that you're the greatest person, be the greatest person anyway, okay? Be the greatest person, in your opinion, of yourself, okay? Be number one in life. Put yourself first, okay? Now, call yourself the greatest person of the world. Yeah, because when you believe it, when you truly believe it, you will be it in your own heart, for sure. And then when you are the greatest person in your heart, obviously, it's going to be in the world also. So, look to give value. Make sure that no matter what happens, you're just growing. You're just making sure you're finding the words to say. Give words. Give words of encouragement. Encourage people. Love them. Smile at them. Shake their hand. Hug them. Go out with them. But make sure that you're going out with the right people. Make sure you're going out with the valuable ones. Those ones who are clubbing every single weekend, have no purpose, are doing drugs, are smoking cigarettes, are poisonous people, uh, playing too much games, those people, stay away from them because they have no passion. They, they, they're lost in life. You, you don't want to be around people who are lost. You, know, you need to be around people who are motivating you, who are millionaires, who are people who are changing the world in some kind of way. Those people have podcasts. Those people have blogs. Those people have YouTube videos. Go and search them up. Go and read their videos. Read their videos and study upon them. What are they doing today? What are they talking about? Why are they talking about this? Go and search it up. And what's so good about this event? Why are they going to this event? Why is he talking about that? Why is it so important? Go through all their videos, okay? And then the more they talk, the, the more they're giving you ideas. And then you pick up on those ideas. It starts becoming interesting. The more you learn entrepreneurship and business, or maybe positivity or personal development, or finance, the more you learn a certain area of life or a certain subject, the better you become. The easier it gets to learn it and the more interested you become in learning that subject. Okay, so it's about learning. When you can learn, you can do anything. Those people who are always students in life, who are always growing, who are always moving forward, guys, those people cannot be stopped. They can never be stopped. So it's about moving forward, making sure that you're motivated, making sure you've got the disciplines you need to become motivated because those people who are motivated always have something to do and are always the most abundant people, okay? Health is wealth, guys. Make sure your health is number one. Make sure that you study upon nutrition. Look upon nutrition. Look about those books that are the best sellers right now in the world and study upon it. Read the book 10 times to actually learn the book and then move forward, okay? Move forward every single day through education. The more smart you are, the more you teach on camera, the more you teach through blogs, the more you write books. Guys, write as many books as you can because the more you write, the better communicator you are, the better speaker you are, the better you practice your craft, okay? So when you're writing your books, okay, when you write 10,000 words, guys, that 10,000 words has helped shape you to become a better person in your craft, okay? To help you become number one. Okay, so when you can speak what you really love to do, guys, that's the meaning of life. It's the meaning that you give it, okay? Give yourself the number one aspect of life. Give yourself the best expression of life. Make sure you're putting yourself out there. Put yourself out there all the time. Make sure that you are always where you need to be. It's about you, so where, you, where are you going? Guys, no matter what happens, you have to be able to better yourself daily. There's no excuses. You can never be showing excuses people who are complaining daily complaining about life complaining about what are they what are they going to do guys those people are losers they're getting nowhere so the best thing you can do is just make sure you're expressing yourself daily because the more you can express yourself the better you become all right the better you become the more you can achieve the more you can do the more you can go places the more you can experience life the more sex you have the more money you have the more friends you have the more family you have the better communicator you are. The more self-esteem you have, the more health you have, the longer life you live. Okay, so no matter what, guys, you have to be able to breathe to the fullest. So if you're a smoker today, guess what? You must quit smoking to be able... You have to be able to breathe. Breathing is the aspect of life that's going to help you succeed. Those people who breathe less in life obviously live a less quality of life. So the whole point of life is to breathe to 100%. Breathe and give 100% all the time. Always giving 100% to everyone that you meet. 
all right? Never look to disturb a friendship, never look to end a friendship, because those people who end friendships are actually always, they're moving forward, but those people who are ending the wrong friendships obviously are losing in life. Make sure you're only removing people who never help you anyway, okay? Those people who never help you, who are only wasting your time, who are not growing you, who are not helping you in some kind of way, who are not encouraging you, who are not giving you value, those people, you have to remove them because when they do not want to be part of you and your life, then you just have to remove them, okay? And you cannot go to people who are violent. You cannot go to people who are causing drama, who are very disturbed, who are very mentally ill, because those people are going to make you that, okay? So who you associate with in life is actually a big part of your life. What do you listen to on a daily basis? Where are you every single day? Who do you live with? Who is around you? Who are the five people around you right now? Who are your five best friends? Who are your close circle of friends, okay? Who were your close circle of friends growing up? And how does it relate to you now? Okay? And how does your family, how has your family impacted you until this point? Okay? And try to solve every single puzzle, every single equation about why are you in this place today? And how, why are you not better? Why are you not in a better place? So that's what it's all about. It's about planning to find out why are you not in a better place than yesterday? Okay? So those people obviously who can become better and become better problem solvers are actually called entrepreneurs and they are going around the world teaching and helping solve other people's problems. Because when you can solve other people's problems, guess what? You can do anything. You can make sure that you can become better. You can make sure that other people are better. You can make sure that you're the most happy because that's the most important thing. It's about getting you to places that is going to help make you more abundant it's going to help you prosper it's going to help you become everything that you ever wanted to be okay so when you can find the words to say when you can do more when you can love more and when you can just be yourself and just love more and just do more and make sure that you're expressing your nature in every single way possible guys no matter how many times you fail make sure you keep growing make sure you keep pushing forward push through the notions okay push through the vitality that you have Okay, vitality is the most excellent thing that you can have. So when you have more sex drive, when you have a better quality of life, when you can breathe better, when you can do more, when you can swim more, when you can exercise more, when you can be athletic. Guys, it's about being athletic. Be athletic in life. Show up for the gym every single day. Guys, do the lightest weights in the gym. Make sure that no matter what, you are building better habits. You are taking those leaps of faith. You're taking the leaps of faith and you're saying, Fuck yes, because I took this decision, look at where I am now. I left home, I went to Melbourne, I went to Adelaide, I went to Brisbane, I went to Gold Coast, I went to Sunshine Coast, I went back to Melbourne, I'm in Hobart now, I'm going to Perth. Guys, see, when you leave home, you get to travel the world, don't you? And you cannot bring your parents along, because obviously they are thinking that they are too old anyway, and they obviously, you'll never convince them anyway to come with you, okay? Because for them, life is hard. But for you, make it easy. Make it life easy for you. Okay? Life is about making it easy for you. When you can make life easy for you, you can actually do anything. Okay? And when it's easy, let it be easier. Yeah? Life is about making your life easier, not harder. Okay? The easier you live, obviously, the more wealthier you're going to be, and the better looking you're going to be, and the better life you're going to have and the better you're going to breathe and the longer you're going to live guys it's about living longer look to live longer look to see what is the long perspective in your life where can i increase my life to become a delay gratification type of person right delay gratification delay people that are trying to fuck you in the wrong way okay so you need to be able to be around those people who are surrounded by positivity and who are leading the world. So the best way to do that is go through audiobooks, go through YouTube, go and see their seminars, go and approach them in real life, go give them money to meet them, yeah, for 10 minutes. They'll teach you something along the way, all right? So always give a millionaire money, always give people money, okay? Give people money when you have money, when you can afford it. When you cannot afford it, make sure that you 
are watching out about how you are investing your money because money is everything in life that's going to help you okay that's it okay money is not everything but it's everything in life that's going to help you in life okay so you need to be able to have more of what's helping you in life and you have to be able to make it and you have to be able to get it and you have to be able to use debt you have to be able to use taxes to your advantage you have to be able to purchase real estate you have to be able to learn real estate you have to be able to learn the economy okay learn about the economy through financial knowledge okay try robert kiyosaki and also grant cardone on youtube and they have a host of videos and you can watch the videos and these guys are my mentors and they help me every single day yes i've never met the guys i've spoken to grant cardone okay on instagram and you just have to make sure that no matter what you are leading a positive life because leading a positive life is everything those people who can lead can breathe they can breathe they can prosper they can do anything okay because they're unshakable no one can stop them all right so guys breathe today breathe make sure you're breathing make sure you're positive make sure that you are putting out those positive vibes and you're becoming a better person throughout life all right life is to take a chance take a chance all right and go somewhere go somewhere take a chance and leave home take a chance and marry the woman that you really wanted okay or that you really needed or whatever so what you need to be doing is always making sure that you need something in life make sure that you need it make sure that you feel that it's the best decision for you and that you actually love to do this okay because no one loves to drink alcohol they think they know okay but they really do not know they actually really desire something better than alcohol okay those people who drink alcohol really are disgusted with it and they think they know everything about alcohol and what about which wine tastes the best like it's so stupid like you're you're synthesizing around 5,000 wines and you're asking like you have to try every single one to see which one's the best because they're all poisonous anyway and it's all gonna kill you and it's all fucking shit anyway and you're just you're you're, you're tasting shit poison like it's so stupid all right romanticizing around drugs romanticizing about sex and pornography guys have less sex have tried to have less sex in life and try to prosper the person you are first try to have the health try to have the money try to have the travels try to be free try to have a better life for yourself first forget the kids forget having a mortgage forget a car try to live your life the best you can with the most money you can so that you can eventually be rich for sure all right there's no get rich quick it's get rich for sure okay and Greg Cardone actually taught me that he says it's not great get rich quick it's get rich for sure all right so throughout life you've got another 50 years another 70 years another 80 years to live guys life is long all right life is very long so make sure that you're thinking long perspective in life and you're not tiring out never be bugs bunny who runs ahead of the turtle all right and then puffs out and is sleeping for two days while the turtle slowly walks past him or past her all right so be the turtle of life go slow when you're in the gym go slow 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 do one muscle at a time for two months get to know every single gym equation and then make a decision after that okay first you have to be able to plan plan your life where are you going what are you doing how do you want to be what do you want to be known for how do you want to be like in the future what what is your mindset at now how, how, how do you think that you are doing what are you going to do where are you going what is the type of person that you would love to accomplish all right so there's nothing to accomplish in life there's just a way for you to breathe better for you to be able to achieve better for you to be able to do better for you able to live more all right so it's about living more it's about doing more it's about making sure that no matter what you are becoming abundant and more abundant throughout the day all right so no matter what just become more abundant all right and look for ways to become more abundant look for ways to increase the person you are in all areas of life okay and when you increase your life obviously you are becoming more positive but when you're decreasing any area of your life then you're becoming worse 
So guys, just do you and love yourself daily, okay? And I'll see you in the next video. How to become better at sales. Guys, there's nothing better in life than a person who is always striving and thriving to sell more. Do you know why? Because salespeople are everywhere. All those advertisements that you see on television, all the people that are promoting posters, creating Facebook advertisements, and on YouTube promoting some type of ads, there are people who are salespeople. Now, what do salespeople represent in life? People who can sell themselves are people who get married. They are people who have more kids. So to have four kids, you have to sell yourself four times to the person that you're having kids with. Now, to have a wife, to have a boyfriend, to have a girlfriend, to have a husband, you need to be able to sell yourself. To be able to have a marriage for 50 years, that is selling yourself every single day. To be able to communicate and give value is selling yourself because it's a self-promotion type of thing. Now, people who self-promote themselves are over people who self-promote themselves are always people who can sell themselves in a loving way. Now, when you are kinder in life, you can also become a better you can all you can also become a better salesperson. People who are kinder in life, they're always people who are selling more having more profit, maximizing their potential, they're doing better than everyone else, and they're always making sure that they are the best that they can be. Now, the whole point of life is to make sure that you are better than yesterday. So when you can become a better salesperson, you can also make sure that you're improving your mindset, that you are around salespeople who have succeeded, and that you're learning from the best of the best. Now, to become a better salesperson, you have to be able to talk. You have to be able to talk and communicate and also be able to public speak because the best salesperson on the planet must learn how to communicate and also how to become a better person throughout life. Now, those people who are always becoming better, they're always making sure that no matter what happens, they have the tools they need to become better in all areas of life. Now, those people who are personal development trainers and coaches and anything in life they have to sell in order to make more money now in life you have to become an author you have to do more things because that's what sales people do in order to get to a better place you have to sell yourself to a better place now you have to sell you that you are the best in the world and that you must do something in life because if you are not convinced of your attitude and who you are and you're not convinced of bettering yourself, then no one else is going to listen to you because people who strive to better themselves and thrive in life are people who are always bettering themselves and they are the people who can influence other people and also motivate other people to become better because that's the ultimate sales pitch. The ultimate sales pitch and becoming a better salesperson is not just making more money, it's also creating balance in your life. So. To become, a, to, be, to, to become a better salesperson, you have to make sure that you are also learning in daily life. Anything that's going to improve you because a person who's balanced is a better salesperson. Because those who have a balanced life, those who are salespeople, are always people who can communicate and influence. Now to be able to influence, you have to be able to sell. And to be able to sell, you have to be able to love yourself. Because those people who are loving themselves, those people who have the mindset to be able to become greater, to be able to become an entrepreneur, to, to solve problems, to be able to plan daily, to be able to lift yourself up the most in life and make sure that you're always growing and always expressing yourself in a different way. Those people are always going to be more disciplined, they're going to be more motivated, they're going to be a high person of life in terms of reputation, in terms of status, in terms of communication, vocabulary, in terms of becoming greater in speaking, in public speaking, in what you do as a person. So it doesn't matter what you do, it's just why do you do what you do, nothing else. So what is your why? Because people who are salespeople always recommend 
and always see and understand what their why is. So for example, my why for selling this video is to give you value. That is my why, that is my why for this video. And that is, what drive, that, that is what drove me to do this video. So when you have a why to become better, you'll become better. When, you have, when your why is strong enough to change the world, you will change the world. You will change the world because you must always be better than yourself. If you're not better than yourself, you will not even watch this video. So to be able to be here with me and listen to this video and hear me out, but not just hear me out, but listen, you will also be a better salesperson because better salespeople are people who are always training themselves, training their minds, making sure that they are looking inside while they're speaking, making sure that they are present in the moment and exactly speaking according to how they interpret life. Now, those people who are interpreting life a better way are obviously going to live a better life. But being able to help those who are unaware and people who are at the bottom right now and who are rock bottom in terms of money, in terms of health, in terms of status, in terms of education, they are the people that we must lift up. Because to be humane in life, to be a person who is far greater than everyone else, you have to be able to lead yourself first. Because leading yourself first leads to sales pitches, it leads, to, it leads to a better vocabulary. It leads to a person who can sell the world on their way of thinking. Now, when you can sell the world on your way of thinking, you're actually giving value. You're actually persuading people by giving them value to better themselves. So when you better people, you'll always have the best selling point. And that's all you need in life to become a better salesperson. The better, the best salesperson on the planet is not the person who makes the most money. It's actually the person who makes the most money, lives the longest, has the best legacy, and is always improving themselves and is better than yesterday. Because there are so many variations of life and not one aspect of life is going to define you. You need all aspects of life in life to be able to never be defined, but also be defined, but never be defined. Now, what do I mean? I mean that life is contradictory because you cannot ever define anyone in life. But what you can do is always better yourself to become a better salesperson so that you can influence, so that you can create big events, so that you can have a massive, beautiful website, and so that you can sell millions of dollars on that website. Because that's the whole goal. Look at Amazon. Look at Amazon, for example. They have this big Amazon website owned by, who was it? It was, I forgot his name. It will come back to me. But the owner and founder of a website called Amazon, the guy is the richest person in the world and he earns and makes millions of dollars just on this website. And where is he on that face? Like, where is he on that website? He's nowhere to be found in terms of where his face is. But everyone sees on Google who's the founder of Amazon. And to be able to better yourself and to be able to find the necessary knowledge that you need to better yourself is to be able to make sure that people are getting a service. Now to get a service, you have to be able to create one. You have to be able to be the service. You have to be the person who is a salesperson. You cannot create a robot to do it for you. You need to do it yourself. So you have to better your habits to create a massive franchise like Amazon that this guy, whoever it was, created so that you can make millions of dollars on that website. That helps people with a service because service is what's going to make you better. Service is what you need in life to better other people and so that you can provide something to also make sure that you are that you are financially free and that you are getting places. So to be able to always make sure that no matter what happened in the past, you move on and you make sure that you keep in this moment because if you keep to the past, you're gonna be full of regret. Those people who are always thinking a second ago, what happened a second ago and how important a second ago was, they are people who are losing out on life because whatever I said in the past, it doesn't matter to me because this moment now 
is the most important because I've learned from the past, I've moved on, and no matter what happens, I'm always learning and I'm always growing. Now, there are no mistakes in life, and those people who think there are mistakes, and those people who think they are failures, and those people who are right-minded and think they're right, and, and those people who are ashamed, guilty, have anxiety, all have one thing in common. They all must grow. Now, those people who are growing, obviously, are always going to be less anxious. They're going to be less angry. They're going to be better sales people. They're going to have less mental health issues. You're going to have more discipline. You're going to have more money. You're going to be able to achieve more spirituality. And you're going to be able to develop yourself into a far greater person. And you're going to be able to lead people. You're going to be able to love yourself. You're going to have Jesus in your life. Okay? You're going to have a greater power on your side. Now, if you don't even believe in Jesus, if you don't even believe in a higher power, just believe in yourself. Okay? And if you don't believe in yourself, guess what? Then you have no other choice. Okay? Your other choice is just commit suicide. It's as simple as that. So the best thing you can do is always make sure you're growing because you will not even be in this video if you are not growing. Because I give you the best value on the planet to make sure that you'll grow. Because value is king, remember that. Money is not king, value is king. The more that you can give value, the better chances you'll make money. The better chances you'll be a better salesperson. The better chances you'll have a sexier boyfriend or girlfriend. Because those people who give value are always people who are salespeople. They are people who sell. They sell you on value, they lift you up, they motivate you, they discipline you. They also show you the gateway. And they show you the direction that you must follow and you must follow the directions you must walk those steps alone and you must make sure that you are improving yourself day in and day out so that you can upload more so that you can upload more to youtube upload more content produce more content make sure that you're communicating in the best way possible and make sh making and making sure that you are producing content that is best for you because it's not about other people it's about you it's not about you, it's about me. So the whole point of this video is to help you, to help me, so that we can help each other, so that we can help grow the world. That's how we must look at life. We must look at life that we are selfish, but in a, in a way that we are improving and never taking. So never take from people, only give. When, people, when someone gives you something, give them a thousand in return and more. Make sure you give them a lot more than they gave you. Because people who are trying to improve you, people who do improve you, always give them back more. Try to give even more. And never try to hold back. Because holding back is going to hold you back in life. So when you hold back, you're only giving 99%. Now, you have to give the full 100% to someone and just blurt it out. Just say it. And spray it. Say it and spray it. But make sure you live it. Okay, and it doesn't matter who teases you and who says that you're this and that and who's criticizing you, guys, believe in yourself the most. Those people who believe in themselves the most are always going to be better salespeople because those people who believe themselves the most and believe in themselves the most, they're always going to have a better reputation, they're always going to love themselves, they're always going to have greater faith. And they're always going to be better than yesterday. So the only vision that you must achieve is not be a better salesperson. It's just be better than yesterday in any area of life. So the more that you can be better than yesterday, the more you can become a salesperson. The more you can lead, the more you can influence, the more you can discipline yourself, the more you can grow, the more you can live life. Now, what does that mean? What does living life mean? It means living to 150. Yeah? Because obviously, I'd rather live to 150 than live to 100. Would you agree? So the whole point of that is to grow daily. So if you want to be like my grandfather who died at 93, then you have to grow daily. And now my grandfather was not a famous person at all, but he grew himself daily to live to 93. And that's better than some famous people like for example Zig Ziglar is a massive, massive inspiration for me. He died, at 60, he died at 86. So my grandfather lived longer than Zig Ziglar. This is just the truth, okay? But obviously Zig Ziglar made a bigger impact and a bigger legacy than my grandfather did. But listen, my grandfather lives through me now. And now I 
take what my grandfather had and I take the torch and I start to do my best to influence myself the most. And that's the whole point guys. You're never putting people down and you're never looking down on people. Okay? I see many people who are in a 9 to 5 job and they're looking down at people like who are looking for the 9 to 5 job, who are looking for employment. And they're like, oh yeah, what job do you want to do? And why do you want to do that? And they're like, they shun you and they criticize you for not having a job. Now, those people who are stuck in the job are worse off than those people who have time freedom, who are not in a 9 to 5 job. So, even the person who is mentally ill, who has no 9 to 5 job, is richer because they have more time than the person who is working a 9 to 5 job. Because at least the person who is mentally ill is not a slave to other people. Because they at least have time out of the 9 to 5 job to do their own thing. Now, in every aspect of life there is a positive and a negative. But what you must do is make more positives in life and make sure that you're looking out for yourself the most. Those people who are looking out for themselves the most in life are always people who are braver, have more courage. They have more courage, which is another word for brave and being braver. So when you can be more brave, you can also have more confidence and you can also sell yourself and communicate better because those people who have a bigger vocabulary and are learning more are also people who are braver in life. Now, you have to be able to dive into books, dive into sales books, Dive, dive into marketing books, dive into all types of books out there, like for example, spirituality, personal growth, finance. This is all going to improve you. Now, you need finance, you need spirituality, you need personal growth, you need marketing, sales, and also being able to grow yourself daily because that is the foundation of empathy. And empathy is going to make you a greater person. Now, what is, a, what is empathy in life? Empathy is your ability to sell. It's your ability to sell others into a better way of thinking. It's your ability to remain in integrity. Now when you can remain in when you can remain in integrity, when you can be in integrity, what you can do is you can live your talk and speak at the same time. Now those people who have integrity also live their word. Whatever they say, they actually mean it and they actually live it. But there are people who are hypocrites, and a hypocrite is someone who says something but never does it. Now, those people are nobodies. Those people who say it and never do it, they are nobodies. They're just backstabbers. They're just talking negatively about everyone. Now, those people who are integrity are people who have left the crowd, they influence on social media, and they actually teach you something, they give you value, and those are the people that you must be around. Those people who are giving you value are never talking about people in a negative way. They may talk and say something on video about someone, but they'll do it positively. Okay? And now when you lift people positively, no matter what it is, you must always be able to talk behind someone's back in a positive way. And always be lifting people. Never be dragging people down. Never do gossip. Never do gossip because gossip has got everything to do with politics. People who choose gossip who are in politics always against one another now never do gossip because you're downlifting yourself and you're not doing anything good for anyone so the best thing you can do is make sure that when you gossip you gossip in a positive way and say no that guy was good she was she's a good woman she just has to become more aware and that's it and you just remain positive throughout your conversations with everyone. If someone says for you to agree with them that someone is negative, never agree with them that someone is negative. But remain positive throughout your life. When you can remain positive, as Zig Ziglar said, positivity will get you further than negativity ever will. Now what you can do is make sure that you are always making your fortune by working on yourself. Jim Rohn. Because those people who work on themselves, guys, if you're working on yourself, you're definitely going to be an influencer. You're going to make millions of dollars. You're going to make billions of dollars. But all you have to do is improve one habit at a time every single day to be able to sell yourself better. Because when you sell yourself better, you're living in integrity. And integrity is the best sales pitch on the planet. As Zig Ziglar said, 
your number one weapon in life is integrity. So when you can live your word and live it, you can also achieve anything you need to in life. So the only thing that you need in life is to grow. And when you can grow, you can achieve everything. So remember, daily, always find something to do that's going to help you grow in some aspect of your life. And make sure that you are investing more time in yourself. So stay away from the nightclubs because nightclubs can take easily 30 hours from your life on the weekends. I was taking 30 hours of my life every single week just for clubbing. So what I would do is I would go to work or whatever, come back at say four o'clock and then go and leave at six o'clock to go night clubbing and then come back five in the morning. Guys, that's 11 hours. What did I do? Just with friends in a nightclub or at the, at the casino in Sydney. Doing what? Chasing women? Trying to get laid? 11 hours of my life was wasted. But not just that, I was doing 30 hours a week. And once you keep that up, that's going to make you fail so much. So what you need to do is always invest your time there with better people. So the best thing you can do on the planet is be on your own throughout life. Because the more that you can invest time in you and be alone and just be away from people, just let them be. Let them go and hang out with those women and men. Let them have the woman. Let them have the men. Let them go and hang around with each other doing drugs and smoking cigarettes while you are learning throughout the scenes and learning behind the scenes in silence and then boom, suddenly you're a social media influencer and suddenly all eyes are on you. All of them will be talking about you because you have done something for the past five years while they were fucking doing nothing. So that is the thing about being a salesperson. It is do something for nothing not nothing for something. So when you're working a 9 to 5 job, make sure you're doing something at the 9 to 5 job and you're not wasting time. Make sure that you're giving you 100% because the best salesperson on the planet gives their best, remember that. So those people who are giving their best every single day and giving and never taking from anyone. If someone gives you something, give them tenfold in return. Make sure that you can give something to someone because that makes you valuable. A person who is valuable is always going to be the best person on the planet because only valuable people are to be understood and to be admired. Remember that. Those people who are just improving themselves and always lifting themselves, those people are always going to make sure that you get to a better place. And you just have to make sure that no matter what happens, you're always improving yourself in terms of your communication. So writing is a big deal. To be a better salesperson so the more that you can write the more that you can teach the better salesperson you're going to make because a teacher is a seller a person who teaches sells the most the person who can sell the most value can also sell anyone else because the person who has the most value always gains the more the, always gains the most profit and will always gains the most money and always has the best things in life they have the grander things in life now, what you need to do is make sure that you get the knowledge, 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 Robert Kiyosaki. Get the knowledge. If you need to improve your finances, read financial books. Read financial books and start off with Robert Kiyosaki and Grant Cardone. Now, with Grant Cardone, you need to read real estate because real estate is going to get you into a better pattern. And now, Grant Cardone is a big salesperson on the planet. And he can teach you sales also. So read from him. Now, the whole point of being a better salesperson is create better habits. Habits are everything in life. In all aspects of life, in all topics of life, habits is the first thing you must talk about. Because habits play a role in your life the most. Your habits, your routine, your meditation is all the same thing. So your meditation is your habits. Your habits is your schedule. Now, the most greatest aspect of your life is your ability to manage your time so that when you can start eating better, when you can actually have a greater mindset, 
through eating habits and also through business, through entrepreneurship, through journaling, through planning daily is very important. You guys have to plan daily. When you guys do all of this, you can then make sure that you're going to become a better person. And a better person is always a better salesperson. Because the best thing that sells in life, the best attitude on the planet is always the person who is always better than themselves in any, in any aspect of life and in every aspect of life. Because the best selling point is your attitude. Dr. Wayne Dyer. Guys, you've got nothing else to sell but your attitude. Improve your attitude, improve your life. Dr. Wayne Dyer. No matter what happens guys, just make sure that you are lifting yourself every day. That's the most important. Every day you must lift yourself. Your number one goal in life is you. Your number one goal in life is to improve yourself. Your health comes first. Now when you improve your health, you will do anything to do it. And that means stay away from late nights. Stay away from caffeine. Stay away from alcohol, drugs, legal drugs, illegal drugs medication stay away from it because health comes first remember that you have to discipline yourself when health comes first you're always going to study nutrition you're going to study nutrition and you're going to be able to lose weight you're going to get into the gym you're going to get into the gym because better salespeople look better when you can sell yourself as a model and you look fucking sexy then people are much inclined to come up to you and to say hi and to call you sexy and to call you hot, to call you gorgeous because that's what you are. So make sure that you're always becoming sexier so that that is your sales point. Because when people see that you're sexy, you've got nothing to say for that. You just fucking show it. You show off your sexiness. And you have no need to say anything because words Never speak louder than actions. Your actions will speak louder than words. So each time you take a little action to become sexier, to get into the gym, to do the weights, to do the video, to do the stretching, to do something to improve others, eventually over time, you're gonna have this massive university. Then you can create a university out of it. You can manifest a big event just through all the information that you've spoken. So the more value you give for the world, the more financially free you're going to be. And that's the best way to become financially free today. So those people who really need to be better salespeople are people, are people who need to become also more financially free. So financially, so financially free life, the financially free life is going to help you always become a better person through money and through your mentality. Now, you always have to improve your life and you have to make sure that money is never first because you are first. Now, money is not evil, money is good, but to have more money is going to help you sell better. A woman much rather, a woman will, a woman would, a woman would much rather go for a man who has money than the person who is broke. And a man rather go for a woman who has money than the woman who is dependent on their father. So the more that you can increase your status, the better for you. Get famous. Become someone. The, the more famous you get, the more you can be with famous people. So why not enjoy the high life in terms of the high spiritual life, not the fast track. Now people are taking the fast track and they're using drugs, they're wasting time, they're going clubbing, they're chasing women, they're having sex five, six days a week. Now you have to discipline yourself to stay away from the drugs, stay away from the people that are going nightclubs, stay away from nightclubs altogether. You have more money. You have more money when, you're, when you stop alcohol. You have more money when you stop cigarettes. You have more money when you stop caffeine. You have more money when you stop the eating you have more money when you stop eating meat. When you become a vegan, you have 10 years longer to live. So anything that can add life to you, or add life for you, do it. And never look back. Make sure that you never look back to how you were in terms of 
bad experiences, but make sure that you learn from those bad, bad experiences and that you're never stuck in regret because regret means to be stuck in the past. So if you are stuck when you were a child, when you were, if you are stuck when you were a child, then you need to be able to grow from that. So you need to open the person you are. You need to be able to unblock everything in your power to become better than yesterday. So you may be 40 pounds heavier than you were when you were 15. So what you have to do is you have to study nutrition for two, three years. I did it in the first year and I lost 23 kilos. So you have to study nutrition because you're fat. It's so simple. And once you do that, you're going to lose the weight because each day you, you see a few words, you learn a bit by bit, you learn nutrition. What does this do? And how do I improve my, my eating habits? And you ask yourself questions based on health and you're going to lose weight. And when you lose 40 pounds and you look sexier than before, that is a greater sales point. You're going to become a better salesperson. So obviously when you are making $50,000 a year and then you get it up to $500,000 a year, you're going to have better success and you're going to have also a better sales point. So the best success on the planet is also the best sales person. The best sales person on the planet has the best success in the world. The more you increase your success is also the more you increase all areas of your life. So increase your spirituality, increase your mindset, increase the looks, have bigger muscles, have more success in all areas of your life, in your relationships, in your friendships, in your travels, in your life skills, in your time management, in your planning, in your journaling, in your influencing, in your influencing videos. Produce more content, give more value, practice your skills, craft, and craft and craft and make more and make more and do more and you're going to become better learn more and you'll become better increase your skills because it does not get easier Jim Rohn so the more that you can increase your skills you can also make sure to be ahead of life those people who are ahead of life are always people who are planning they are people who are Better than yesterday, there are people who are disciplined to discipline themselves even more. So the more that you can discipline yourself to stay away from gratification, from sex, stay away from sex, because obviously if you're not getting none, then stay away from it for two, three years, and then later on, you're going to acquire even more of it. Because if you're out there chasing sex, then you're wasting your time on these women that don't give a fuck about you, and you're just like a rat chasing cheese. Never be a rat chasing cheese. You can never chase anything in life. You don't get sex, fucking you don't need sex. How about that? And there was a woman who said, how about that? And everyone started teasing her. Look at her, she, now she's a big rock star. She's a rapper. She, she doesn't give a fuck what people think of her. But at least people know her. At least people view her. At least people give her attention now. And that's the whole point. To have a better sales point, you need more attention. Attention is the eye. Have bigger eyes. Now what do I mean? Have a bigger vision. The bigger your eyes, the bigger your vision. So what is your vision? You have to make one. You have to make a better vision than you have. So the best vision that you can have in life is make sure that you're prospering and becoming abundant. And become more abundant than yesterday. And become more abundant than yesterday. Be a person who is always teaching. Be a person who is always growing. Now, the best vision on the planet is being better than yesterday. And when you can achieve that, you can also become a better salesperson. Because to have more success is to increase balance in your life. Balance is everything. When you can improve your weaknesses and your strengths, you can also improve all areas of your life. Now, work on your strengths and make sure that you are only doing what makes you the best okay never do what makes you the weakest because when you do what makes you the best you're always going to pr improve your weakest point now what is your weakest point in life now your weakest point in life is what you must do next 
Now, the weakest point in life is your next leap of faith. It's like, fuck, I have to go from video now to fucking public speaking in front of people. And I have to do it for free. And I have to create the events. I have to create I have to create the I have to create the events and I have to go and show myself to hundred people and speak about my craft. And I also have to get there, I have to advertise it, I have to learn advertising to be able to do this. So that's the next leap of faith. So then, that is the weakness that you must overcome. So how do you do it? You work on your strengths, you do your craft, craft, craft it, craft it, and produce it. Produce it, produce it, produce it. Get good enough with your craft, and your craft and your strength is going to propel you to make that leap. So, when you're focusing on your weaknesses, you're always going to delay. But when you're focusing on your strengths and you're doing what you're very good at, you're always going to prosper, you're going to become better. So always look at what are your top three strengths and just do that. Now your top three strengths in life are your top three goals. What are your top three goals in life? See, my biggest strength in life is growing every single day. That's my number one strength in life. They call me the James Bond of growth. I am the James Bond of growth. Because I always wanted to be James Bond. I always wanted to be the actor James Bond. The guy who has a tuxedo, who has the gun, and who has the woman who is a badass. And now, I am the James Bond of growth, and that means that no one grows better than me in life. I grow the most for my age, definitely, and for every, for every single age, I grow the most now. Do you know why? Because I provide myself the best value on the planet, and I make sure to go get it. Now, I'm a go getter. What does that mean? That means that when I have an insight, I fucking take action and I do it. And I dive in, I dive in, and then I learn as I go. Now, when I first started creating YouTube videos, fuck I was shit. Like honestly, I made all these random videos and I started on one minute a day. And I created and I uploaded 500 videos and I fucking got 74 subscribers. Like fucking nothing. And here I am, now making fucking one hour videos for all these type of playlists that I have on my YouTube and I'm having the most fun in the world because I'm practicing my craft and I'm becoming a better communicator and a better salesperson because I give value and because I have something to talk about. I'd rather have something to talk about that gives value than have nothing to talk about and never show my face. I'd rather show my face because later on in 50 years time I'll get to look at myself in the mirror which is my video right now. I get to revisit the past. And I get to leave something behind for my family to read upon for themselves. Now, if, if the world does not give a fuck about this video, then my family will. And that's it. And for myself, it doesn't matter what happens in life. Whether you get the value or not. I gave you the value, it's up to you now. What are you going to do about it? The best thing you can do is grab it, take action, and apply it. Now, you must be able to give value to others to become a better person of value. The person who gives more value is much more valuable to the world. Because the more content you produce, the better you are. We are all producers of life. So you must be able to do something in life to get out of the 9 to 5. This is just my way of getting out of the 9 to 5. Now, the best way that you can become a salesperson is improve your habits. Improve your habits, grow daily, plan daily. And when I mean plan, I mean journal your thoughts. Solve your problems on your paper. Now, when you use paper, use your electronic device and use your note system on your iPhone or Samsung. And then, use Google Drive, the application Google Drive or Dropbox, and put your notes in there and store them. So, if you do lose your phone, that at least your notes are stored, okay? And you can use it for reference later on. Now what you do is, you just make sure that you're always improving your writing, improve your voice, improve your muscles, improve your mindset, improve your looks, improve your money making skills, improve your communication skills, improve your life in all areas. 
and you'll become a better salesperson. That's the best way. There is no other way. There is only become better than yesterday. So if you're doing everything in your life right now, what you've always been doing, you'll never grow. You'll always be the same. Albert Einstein. But what you can do is always do something different. Like for today, for example, I did a stretching series for the first time and you can go check it out. It's on my playlist. And it's the one that says Soul Growth Stretching Series or Stretching Lessons. So I still have to name it, but you can go on my playlist and check it out. And I did it and I had the most fun. But guys, have the most fun guys. Have the most fun. So to have to to be able to have the most fun, you need to be able to make sure that you're growing. Because growing is the most fun. Being able to grow, being able to be more disciplined, being able to become the master of your sexuality, being able to stay away from sex, being able to travel the world while everyone else is stuck in one place. Guys, it's the best feeling in the world. There's nothing more fun than a person who is growing. Nothing more fun. There's, people may judge you, but as long as you are growing, they can never outjudge you. Now, no matter what happens, no one can define you. So what you need to be doing is always making sure that you're lifting others and screw the rest. Because only those who are viewing you, are only those who view you are important. That is your crowd. That is your fans. So what you need to do is always give them value and always make sure to self-promote yourself because a person who is very sexy, who has the best communication skills, who is practicing public speaking, who is growing daily, who is reading books, who is always reading audio books and making sure to read faster than yesterday in terms of speed reading, in terms of listening to audio faster, they are the people who are going to grow the most. Now when you can grow the most, you can also be the best and you can be the best of the best. Now being the best of the best is the best thing on the planet. Now to get there, you need to create more content. You need to create more and more content and you need, you need to do it now because so far in 2019, YouTube, social media, Facebook, Instagram, Snapchat, TikTok, LinkedIn, Twitter, these sites are for free. So what you need to do is create content and put it out on those sites so that you can become better with yourself to be able to practice your content. Just focus on that. And then make sure that you see that these platforms have only been around for 13 years from 2019. So take advantage. Guys, the internet is early. The internet has been around for 20 years now. And the best thing you can do is make sure to transition into the internet period and produce more content and show your face more. Expose yourself, expose the person you are. But first, make sure you're improving your habits daily. Improve your habits and eventually you'll be able to get on the camera because I was so anxious in my life that I could never show my face. Now I could show my face in terms of showing my face on Facebook, in images and in some videos, but never like this. Now I can create one hour videos, I can create bloopers videos, I can create all these type of videos because I feel sexier than ever. And I'm only growing sexier by the day. So in one year's time, I'll be so much more sexier than this. Because I grow, I grow and I grow. That's the only thing on my mind every single day. Nothing else. No fucking sex is ever going to satisfy me as much as my growing daily is going to help me. No amount of sex will help me like I will help me in life. No amount of sex will help grow me like I can grow me. No amount of sex will help me love me like I love me. Do you understand that? So, even though some people may have sex, all you need to do is just grow and you have even more than them. It's fucking simple. And remember, life is fucking long. Life is long. Life is fucking very long. So, never think you have to do things fast. Use 
the 70 year barrier that you have to promote yourself, to do things faster, to become better than yesterday, to sell, to sell more of what you're doing, to give more value, to become someone in life. Use 70 years to achieve it. Use 70 years and more. Guys, you have over 70 years to live. It's a long time. It's not a short time. Those people that say they're here for a short time or their life is short, like fucking, their life is over. What you need to do is think long term. All right, because life is never short. Life is not here for a short time. Life is eternity. Life is fucking long. So think long perspective. Think long term. Think what will you do with the end in mind? Now, begin with the end in mind means make sure that you have a vision in place that's going to make you better than yesterday. There's nothing else. All right? Those people who can achieve a better you, for example, you can achieve a better you, I can achieve a better me than yesterday. Guys, there's nothing more important than that. I improve myself for me and you improve yourself for you. And that's how you become better. That's how we become better. We must work together to promote each other so that we can promote others, so that others can promote others, so that we can better the world. That is our responsibility, to make the world better. That is our responsibility to make ourselves kinder human beings and make sure that we are impacting the world in the best ways. Because that's what a leader does. A leader will never destroy you. A leader will never degrade you. People who are salespeople are always people who are lifting. Be with the uplifters in life. Be with people who are seminar junkies. Okay, going to seminars, fucking learning, giving money here and there, throwing money at people. Be around those people. Because you need to throw money at people to be able to learn something. Invest money in your mindset, invest money in yourself, in the best things of life. If you have today zero dollars to one hundred thousand dollars, invest it only in yourself. Nothing else. Invest it in your mindset and your business and make sure that you promote yourself daily because guess what? I'm 27 and promoting two, three videos a day over the next 50 years. Hello. There's a so much there is so many there is so much time. That I can do this and I have plenty of time to become famous, to become fame, to become legacy in life, to become someone. So I have all the time in the world. I'm not rushing. I'm just doing things slow. I'm that turtle. I'm a turtle in life or better. So I'm that turtle or better. So guys, I'm always repeating these affirmations with all better at the end because that's what Jack Canfield taught me. He said, when you are repeating stuff, re remember to put it with all better at the end because that way you'll never know exactly what you said. And that's the best thing. Just keep repeating positive affirmations with all better at the end because it's always going to be positive. So no matter what I say, even if it's negative, I'm negative or better. I'm a fucking asshole or better. I'm a fucking poofed up or better. Like, you don't even know what I said because I just said it at the end with all better. So the whole point of that is just for me to meditate and meditation is life. So when you can meditate better, you can also have a better schedule, you can be more productive, you can also increase your net worth, you can increase other people's net worth, you can help people earn millions of dollars, you can earn yourself millions. So that's the whole point. Make sure that you can make yourself financially free by being a social influencer because now it's the internet age. It's the technology age, okay? It's no, it's no longer the industrial age, which is just stands for the fucking nine to five. It's no longer the nine to five jobs because guess what? Robots are coming into place and robots are replacing people in the nine to five. Guess what happens? Because robots are coming into the nine to five, more people have to brand themselves. More people have to get up on social media and more people have to be able to teach others to become financially free because there are, there are going to be less jobs in the world because robots are taking over the place. Now, we live in a time where this is all happening, okay? 
My grandfather lived through the time of the television set, the radio, the internet came out, the World War, Second World War. And he experienced so many things in life that was just taking place. And now we're in the same position where life is going to take place in a better way for us. But we have to take advantage, we have to use our resources, we have to make sure that we are better than yesterday so that we can prosper and be better than our friends. Because that's what it's about. It's about being better than our friends and family were. Make them jealous, but be better than them. Be better than the world. Always seek to be better than the next person. Seek to be sexier than the next person you see. Be the sexiest person in the room. Be the smartest person in the room. Do you know why? Because there's no other way. Be the smartest person in the world. Hello? The world is the room. Be the fucking smartest person. Because what other fucking worlds are there in life? There is a quote. If you are the smartest person in the room, you're in the wrong room. Now, the world is a fucking room. And obviously you must be the smartest in it. So, guys, no matter what, no matter what happens, there is always a quote that is going to help you grow. Now the person who wrote, the person who wrote that there must be whatever it, is, whatever it is in life to help you grow. For example, Lao Tzu. Lao Tzu said that if you become a man of influence, you're always going to be better than yesterday. And that's the whole point. So make sure that no matter what, you're always improving your habits because your habits improve your destiny because your destiny improves everything else now too now guys no matter what when when you see a quote when you see something that someone said never try to drag the person down but try to reveal that quote in a better way and fuck everything else because the best thing you can do in life is just stick to your own guns and make sure that you disable other people in terms of what they say so that you can grow so that you can also lift them in terms of a better way now I mean that disable other people in a better way that's it there's nothing else so those people who can always talk and walk the talk they're the people who are going to be better sales pitchers they're gonna pitch the best because the best pitcher in the world the best person who makes the most money is the person who has the most integrity now the person who is living life the best is always living the life of integrity there's nothing else now it doesn't mean that the person who has Amazon is living in integrity but because he created something that made him rich he only he only became rich because he created it but He's financially rich, okay? He's the richest person in terms of finances. Now, what you need to do is always make sure that no matter what, even though you fail, you just get up and you build resilience. Now, resilience is built through discipline. When you can improve your discipline, you can also improve your sales pitch because those people who get up faster, are learning faster, have more energy faster, have energy faster, are better mindsets, they think alone greater, they do everything greater, they always have they always have the greatest clarity and they always focus about what they say and what they do. Now that is the whole point of being a salesperson. Have better communication skills and express yourself in a different way every single time so that you can practice, 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 practice and make better practice. Okay? Listen, practice never makes perfect, but practice makes better. And better is perfect. Better is better than perfect. So just seek to be better. And once you put on the internet, it's done. Okay, once you put on the internet, there's no going back. Never delete it. Okay, let it be. Because what I've done, I created this playlist, I created about 20 videos, 30 videos, and I deleted it all because I was just unhappy with who I was. So what I've done was I stored it somewhere and now I can re upload that. For people to watch how I was, how I really was before I even started this channel on YouTube. And I was actually fatter and I was way worse than I am today. 
but I try my best. And that's the best thing in life. Do your best. I never tried my best, I've done my best. And I still do my best every day. So never seek to try anything in life because to try is to fail. Now, just do it, as Nike Brand says. Now, no matter what, only promote what you believe in. Now, when you promote anything that is negative, then you're going to become negative. Never be the person who is sober but promoting alcohol. Like, come on, you have to live with who you are. Now, what you need to do is always make sure that you are just increasing your vibrancy, increasing your sexiness and your fondness of who you are in terms of your wisdom, increase your wisdom, apply more knowledge and make sure that you are taking more action daily because knowledge is not power. Knowledge with action is power and those people who are increasing their knowledge are always, are always going to increase the person they are. Now when you increase the person you are, you are more humble, you are more, high, you, you have, you are more highly respected and you have more morals. Now what is morals? A person who has morals has high ethics. Now what is high ethics? High ethics and morals has got everything to do with how much you love yourself and respect yourself. When you have high ethics and high morals, you are also a person who is noble. Now what is a noble person? A noble person is a noble, a noble person is a humble person who is never above anyone. You have equals in life. You are my equal, I am your equal. Now what we must do is become superior and always lead others the best we can. Now never kick someone to say they are below you. Never kick someone to say that they are below you because they are never below you. They are just people who are unaware of their life so what you need to do is lift them okay and lifting is the best humble practice in the world when you lift people you will become also a noble man now that is the whole point of being a noble person who is always respected and who is modest a modest person is noble a noble person is humble a humble person is modest model modesty a model Anything in life must improve. So a person who is modesty, a person who is noble, a person who is humble must always improve and improve others because that is the definition of those words. Now, when you can become positivity and an optimist, which is another word for a positive person who lifts people, then you can also become a salesperson because the whole point of lifting and pitching and doing everything in life and everything that you do and waking up is to grow. So the first thing that must be on your mind when you grow and then when you wake up in the morning is to grow. That's your first thought. Today I must grow. Straight up, that's your first thought of the day. And you must be able to apply the knowledge in the day by writing it down on paper. Many people go through life missing out on what is happening in the world because they get so many thoughts in their day that they never write it down and they miss out big opportunities because me for every second of every day i write every fucking i write every fucking thought that i have that is going to improve myself now i never disrupt myself i only improve myself now words are words words will never offend you and words will never take you down but those people who are doing negative things are always going to drag everyone else down with them. Now, be around the people who are doing positive things, making a difference. Be around people who are social influencers and only seek to, to do what people are doing that is positive. So when you see a positive thing, make sure that you are thinking in terms of doing what is positive. So do only what is going to get you higher. Now also do what you've never tried and do what you've never done because that's also a new experience and that's also trial and error. Now when the more you can do something you've never done, the more wisdom you're going to acquire and life is wisdom. This world is wisdom. The more wisdom you acquire, the better salesperson you are. Guys, please give me a like and a thumbs down. Give me whatever you got.
please make sure that you are engaging with me and making sure that you guys are following my videos and also watching any of the other ones I've created in the past because they're all going to help you and please click over here for those videos and please follow my journey and make sure that you guys subscribe make sure you give me a like and also please go and check out my Instagram at Danny Milvojevic which is in the title of this YouTube video and get yourself those quote books in my YouTube description which are also found on my Instagram bio link and join my veganism community veganism media, veganism media community on Facebook and join in the crowd and please let's win and let's just grow together and always make sure that we become better salespeople and the whole point of this video is just to make sure that you gain value and that you become a better person throughout it so I provided the most I could in this video because there are so many more videos to come that one hour can be enough for this video and then we can continue in other videos and you can also follow my journey and we can follow each other's journey just make sure that you engage with me and ask me questions anyway guys thank you very much and see you guys in the next video and make sure that today you be inspired and make sure that no matter what you're never losing because the person who is losing is never a winner and we are winners so we only grow and growing is a foundation of living.